Hi everyone, I'm Jeff Teague with Fred Anderson Toyota and this is Ali, our master diagnostic technician. He's going to give you the nuts and bolts in a tour so you learn more about what is a Toyota hybrid system? What is it? What parts make it up? What are the benefits and how you can know what you're looking at? Okay, we are trying to cover what is a hybrid and what does it do and trying to simplify some of it and get rid of the mysteries. A hybrid but as the name implies, is propelled two ways. And in our case, it's electric and gasoline work in conjunction with each other. You can have, in our case, we have a parallel system called Hybrid Synergy, which works at gasoline engine, works at electric engine, or works with both at the same time. Just to demystify, what is in a hybrid is uh, first of all the gasoline engine is like any other engine that sits right there most of the time with any Toyota as long as I know is all Toyotas the engine is on the passenger side of the vehicle on the left side we have this guy is called the inverter converter what it does is it supplies the 12 volt power to a 12 volt battery it supplies the high energy battery to propel the transmission the transmission is all electric motor and it seats underneath this box as you notice there is a small battery this is the 12 volt battery in this case it's in front of the engine if you ever do need to jump it you can just jump it at the battery on some of our hybrid the 12 volt battery is in the trunk. And let's follow over here. If the 12 volt battery is in the trunk and you need to jump it, you go into the fuse box, under the fuse box, there should be a red connector. You lift it up, connect the jumper positive there, connect the jumper negative to anywhere on body ground, this way you don't have to go into the trunk to jump the car and the trunk would not work because it's electric hatch to begin with. That's right. In this case, the battery is in the trunk, is in this hole. You should never really have to go there. If you need to access it for jumping, as we said earlier, you can jump it in the front. Okay, we've had some questions about exactly what the hybrid transmission does and some of the components and what they do and why some of the wires are painted orange in our vehicles. If you see an orange wire anywhere around the hybrid engine, probably the best thing to do is stay away from it. That's the high <laughs> voltage system. And if there is no issue to touch it, don't mess with it. Inside of our transmission, which is underneath this black box, is the hybrid transmission. It has two main components. They are MG1 and MG2. One of them is responsible for starting the uh, gasoline engine. It works as a starter and it also propels the car backwards and forwards. The other one creates charge to go through the inverter into the battery to charge the system and the two components together can drive the can propel the car at the same time this is a 2021 venza and it's self-explanatory i cannot tell you how long it will last and will it have issues however within the last 20 years the engines that are made very much like this the transmissions have been super dependable nothing has gone wrong with them they stay in very good shape. Uh, the hybrid battery on them usually lasts 180 to 200,000 miles. And they're becoming cheaper and cheaper and cheaper as they go. So it's absolutely worth it if you can have a car for 200,000 miles and then replace the battery and get a huge amount of mileage on it afterwards. That's right. And Toyota just came out starting with 2020, a new hybrid battery warranty that's a lot larger than what we're used to. You want to explain about that, Ali, please? Yes. Toyota used to have eight years, 100,000 mile warranty. 
on our hybrid batteries. And then the mines to be at Toyota decided with all the years that people have been driving, they're still a little hesitant about a hybrid engine. So they decided to extend it to put people's mind at ease. Right now, the hybrid uh, uh, battery warranty has been extended. They call it the extended battery warranty uh, for 10 years, 150,000 months. Wow, that should give people peace of mind. <laughs> yes, it does. Okay, we've been asked where the battery pack is. The battery pack is under the rear seat. And if you look with that brown connector, it goes to the battery pack. And it's not much to look at. It's gonna look like an aluminum box, all self-contained. And you should really never have to mess with it. If the battery pack needs service, it needs professional people dealing with it. As long as what sort of battery packs we have in here, there is two types that are available in the market right now. It's nickel metal hybrid and it's a lithium ion battery. Each of them have their own and each of them have their own chemistry and we're gonna go into it in a different video on how they work and what's the difference. Thank you for watching. I hope we have demystified some of this stuff. I've been working on this for 20 years plus and I feel perfectly comfortable with it. And I hope that uh, we have uh, made it easy for you to understand how some of this stuff works. And if you have any questions, please send us a questionnaire and we'll answer you.